Osh out if you have an opportunity to go. I would take full advantage of it. Here's Skylab 7 for you overlooking the Potomac and Georgetown. The clouds really have not budged a whole lot, and we are looking at just a few breaks here and there, allowing for skies to brighten just a little bit. But as you move through the afternoon hours, we could see a pop up shower, heavier downpours, even a rumble or two of thunder, but we're not expecting anything to become severe. We've warmed up already to 86 degrees at Reagan National Airport, 83 this hour at Warrenton. Head to Gaithersburg, Germantown, and Rockville. You're in the lower to middle 80s. Feels like temperatures already cracking that 90 degree mark. So if you are going to be outside today, grabbing a bite to eat for lunch or doing a little bit of exercising or taking your dog out for a walk, make sure that you stay well hydrated with our heat index values that are going to be in the lower 90s. Here's our satellite and radar for you. We did have a few showers off toward the west of us earlier. Now a few showers developing across extreme southern Maryland, but no thunder and no lightning. Just some heavy uh, downpours at this time. You can see it on our future cast. It's a lot smaller here, but notice as we head through the afternoon hours, skies could open up with those heavier downpours at any point. So we're not going to pinpoint any specific areas because they're going to be very widespread. But this model here by 3 p.m. shows a little bit of action over the district before finally clearing on out. And then most of the showers will be out of here by about sunset tonight. Going out to lunch, temperatures are in the middle 80s, clouds over sun. As we move through the evening rush hour commute, here's a live view looking over at 270 in Maryland. Traffic is moving nicely now. Temperatures 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock will be in the middle 80s. A stray shower or two cannot be ruled out. Waking up tomorrow morning, it's warm, it's hazy a little bit of patchy fog, but nothing that's going to cause any type of air travel delays around 70 degrees. Arlington, Alexandria in the district highs tomorrow off to the west of us. The Panhandle of West Virginia, upper 80s to around 90 degrees. The district will be at around 90 degrees and maybe a little bit hotter than that as you head down to K Street and Capitol Hill with all the concrete, lower 90s. Southern Maryland, upper 80s to lower 90s and just to the south and west of us, orange and Culpeper around 90 to 92 degrees. Here's your seven day outlook from Stormwatch 7. Once we do get through this afternoon, we're looking at 90 degrees on Tuesday, lower 90s on Wednesday. We'll stay at or above 90 on Thursday, and then we're tracking a stronger cold front that is set to arrive during the day on Friday. This cold front may trigger some strong to severe thunderstorms, but look at that. The weekend looking really good with temperatures that are going to be in the upper 80s. All right, Steve, thank you. Coming up on ABC 7 News at noon, Take a look at this wreckage. This was after a driver lost control near a dealership. We're going to have details on this coming up. Every single morning and again at night, you should always brush your teeth from the left to the right. Fight cavities and get your checkups on. Natty Kid carrying all this with his lots of fun. Do you take most insurance? Yeah, you bet. Quality care with Medicaid? Oh, uh, yeah. No Clean all your pearly whites in a fun spot. The teeth exams, cavities get fought. Yeah. Captain Smile says, brush your no. teeth. Adventure Dental and Orthodontics makes it easy to get your kids the care they need. Call or go online today. Brush your teeth. America's